Lost My Tooth by Mo Willems. Now this is the Unlimited Squirrel series, which is a different Mo Willems series than the Elephant and Piggy series or the Pigeon series. Um, but I thought some of you might enjoy this because I bet some of you have lost a tooth. Let's see what happens. This is read with permission of Hyperion, which is part of Disney World Publishing. You know, I love my Mo Willems end papers. Look at all those different squirrels. Flappy squirrel looks kind of like a bird. Hmm. This is a big book. It's full of big fun. So come on, let's open it. Hi, I'm Zip Squirrel. There's so much to read in this book. So let's zip to it. Squirrel Pals, it's the table of contents. It's the table of contents. The big story, page one. Look for the Emota acorns in the story. They pop up when the squirrels have big feelings. Confused, surprised, sad, determined, scared, happy, and funny. Ready for the big story? Here we go. I lost my tooth. What did you say, Zoom Squirrel? I lost my tooth, Fip Squirrel. What did Zoom Squirrel say? You mean Zip Squirrel. I lost my tooth, Fap Squirrel. Zap Squirrel? Did you say you lost your tooth, Zoom Squirrel? Oh, yes. Oh, no! Zoom Squirrel lost a tooth. We must find it. Find that tooth! That poor tooth! All alone! What happened? Tell us. We need a clue. Yes. The tooth was loose. Aha. You should not let a tooth go loose, Zoom Squirrel. Teeth have no sense of direction. You should have used a leash. You must be so upset that you lost your tooth. Do not worry, because it's okay. We will find your tooth. We will look near. We will look far. Um, we will ask every squirrel. We will describe the tooth. Huh? How? We do not know what the tooth looks like. Can you describe the tooth, Zoom Squirrel? Um, it was a baby tooth. <gasps> a baby tooth! Poor baby, all alone. It's so sad. It must be hungry. Don't speak. We understand. We are here for you. We have your tail. Poor lost toothy tooth. Squirrels, our job is clear. Find that lost baby tooth. Squirrels away. While I was sleeping, I will check under my pillow. <laughs> Bad news, Zoom Squirrel. We did not find the baby tooth. Zoom Squirrel? Zoom Squirrel? Zoom Squirrel? Oh no! We lost Zoom Squirrel! First the tooth! A baby 
baby. Now Zoomy, a squirrel, lost. And I thought this was going to be a happy story. Wow! Hi guys! Squirrels! Look! Zoom Squirrel is back! With the baby tooth! Hooray! Do you know what that means? It could mean that Zoom Squirrel found the tooth. Or it could mean the tooth found Zoom Squirrel. What a brave tooth, a hero. You must be so proud. Wow, shh, quiet. The baby tooth needs to rest. It looks tired. Nap time, sweetie. I will get the baby buggy. We will take it from here, Zoomy. It is so cute. Careful, hurry. Here's the baby buggy. something today. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Whoop. Squirrels do not know much about teeth. This is the end of this squirrely tale. And this is the end of this squirrely tale. Now, one of the fun things with this series is there's more. Remember how we had our table of contents at the beginning? There are more things happening in here. They have a corny joke, research rodent, another corny joke, for real, bonus a corny joke, and the tale ends. So let's see what's in here. It's a corny joke time. Hi, corn. Why should you always brush your teeth before going to bed? Hey, corn. Beats me. Why should you always brush your teeth before you go to bed? Because it's too messy to brush them in bed. I'm a nut. You really are a nut. That story was squirrely fun. Yes. But it made me wonder, what are teeth made of? That is easy, Boom Squirrel. Teeth are made of a bunch of tooths. But what is tooth made of, Blink Squirrel? Oh no, we need help. We need facts. Did some squirrel say facts? It's Research Rodent. Help us, Research Rodent. What are tooths made of? Well, scientists have asked that question and done research about it. Here is what they learned. Turn the page to find out. The truth about your teeth. Your teeth are hard on the outside and soft on the inside. The hard outside of your teeth is good for biting. It is made of strong enamel. Tooth enamel is stronger than your bones. The soft inside of your teeth is made of nerves and tissue and they keep teeth healthy. Unlike Zoom Squirrel's big story, squirrels do not lose their front teeth. Squirrels do lose their back baby teeth and they grow new ones, just like you do. Squirrels use their front teeth for opening food, such as nuts and fruit. Squirrels' back teeth are for chewing. 
A squirrel's age can be counted by the rings inside its teeth, just like the rings of a tree. Hooray for research rodent! Research rocks. That's a theory. It's a corny joke time. Hey, corn, what kind of train is always eating? Hi, corn, I'm stumped. What kind of train is always eating? A choo-choo train. <laughs> a joke with bite. It was hard to swallow. It's for real with Quiz Squirrel. I'm Quiz Squirrel and this quiz is my biz. Today's quiz is who on has only one set of baby teeth? We have a bear, a shark, and a houseplant. Think about it. Who has only one set of baby teeth, a bear, a shark, or a house plant? Do you know the answer? Say it out loud and say why. Then turn the page. Ready? It's the bear! Yay, bear hug! Brown bears, black bears, polar bears, even panda bears have only one set of baby teeth that they lose and replace. A grown-up bear has up to 42 teeth. Sharks, however, can lose thousands of teeth in a lifetime. Plants do not have teeth, and that is okay. Neither do birds, but snakes do have teeth. Some spiders, snails, and slugs have teeth, too. I do not have teeth. But you do have friends, Flappy Squirrel. This is Quiz Squirrel saying, there's always something more to learn when you have a page to turn. I think it's our last corny joke. It's a corny joke time. Hey, corn. What do you call a bear with no teeth? Hi, corn. I don't know. What do you call a bear with no teeth? A gummy bear. <laughs> that barely made sense. The tail end. Thanks for reading, squirrel pals. Wait! We almost forgot the best thing about teeth. They help make smiles. Oh, and look, it's our old friend Pigeon right down there. Okay guys, that was kind of fun. I Lost My Tooth by Mo Willems, published by Hyperion Books. Thanks so much.